Everyone is complaining about using up time. Fianna Fáil have every backbencher on their feet all week, using every right, yeah. minute they can get. And they're hardly talking about judicial appointments at all. They talked about child abuse, the bus strike, the post office closures, everything under the sun. has been amazing to watch them filibuster. Every time you look up at the telly in your office, it's the judicial appointments bill and another very often not well seen uh, Fianna, Fianna Fáil backbencher on their feet. And then they'll complain that the left get too much time and that's the problem with bills being blocked up. When actually in fact, there's very little, uh, the, the sky ain't going to fall in if this is passed and that's the way Fianna Fáil are behaving. Oh my God, this would be terrible. The walls of the King's Inn would be breached. You'd never be, you'd never have justice again. All they're asking in the bill that I can see that fundamentally changed, maybe the, 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 the legal expert here could correct me on this, is that the lay people would have a majority on the appointments board as against the, the non-lay people and actually they'll be scrutinising who the lay people are and judges were always political political appointees. That's a well sort of accepted fact that at least and, and even a Fianna Fáil appointed judge last year said at least a third of every um, uh, judge appointed is, is a political appointee. Fiona, it, you're, you're, sorry Owen, you, you want to come in there and then 